Okay guys, in this video I am going to show you how to fix Windows Explorer restarting problem. So first you need to restart Windows Explorer via Task Manager. To do that you need to press Ctrl, Shift and ESC together. Then it will be open Task Manager. Alternatively you can just right click on the taskbar then after tap on Task Manager. That also work. Under the process section you can see Windows Explorer in here. Simply tap on it. Then after tap on restart. This will restart the Windows Explorer. And this will uh, fix the minor glitches without rebooting the PC. So if it is not working, you can try the next method. That is, you have to update the video drivers. To do that, right click on the start menu. Then after go to device manager. You can see display adapters option here, double tap on it, select your graphic driver, right click on it, tap on update driver. So again tap on search automatically for drivers. You can see I already installed the best driver for my graphic card. So you can alternately try to go back again and select the second option in this menu and select the let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer, select that one, select your already existing graphic driver tap on next this will reinstall the graphic driver so the next method is you have to run the system file checker to do that go to search bar search for command prompt you can simply type cmd and right click on it tap on run as administrator okay once it is open you need to type sfc space forward slash scan now then hit enter once it is finished you have to again type dism space slash online space slash cleanup dash image space slash restore health like this then hit enter once you type that command and hit the enter you have to restart your computer this will repair the corrupted system files Next method is you can boot into the safe mode. If you experience in this issue, once you install new Windows update or new software update, you can uh, uninstall that one in the safe mode. To do that, you have to first go to start menu. Then after go to setting. Left side menu, select the system option. Right side menu, you need to scroll down and select the recovery option. Select the advanced startup restart now option. Once you restart, you can see this kind of menu appear. So you need to select the troubleshoot option in this menu. Then after select the advanced options. Then select the startup setting option. Then after tap on restart. Once it is restarted, you have to press 4 key or F4 key in your keyboard to enter the safe mode. Then try Windows Explorer is perfectly working on that safe mode. If it is yes, that means the Explorer is crashing by just third party software. So you can simply uninstall that software in the safe mode. So next method is you have to test your RAM card. To do that, you have to press the Windows key and S key on your keyboard. Alternatively, you can go to search bar, type Windows Memory Diagnostic like this. Simply tap on it. Select the Restart now and check for problems. This will restart your computer and check your memory related issues. If they are uh, fixable, it will automatically fix that. So the next method is, you can press Windows key and R on your keyboard. It will open run menu. Now you need to type msconfig. Hit enter. So once it is open, you have to go to the services tab. There is an option called hide all Microsoft services you need to tick this one then after you need to again tap on the startup option 
tap on open task manager so you can see these are the application effect to start up your computer so you have to disable all the unnecessary application that are currently enabled so you can see this one is currently enabled if you don't need that one simply select that one tap on disable option once it is done you can tap on ok then after restart your computer as a final step you can use shell x view kind of uh, problematic extension disable so you can download shell x view then after you can it will be able to disable non microsoft shell extension which can cause explorer crashes so then after restart explorer after disabling suspicious extensions so these are the method you can try to fix windows explorer uh, restarting problem if you think this video is helpful please consider subscribe and like in this video